I got a comment a couple weeks ago about the glue pin that I use for glue basting, and this is it. This is a dual tipped board mate variety of Elmer's glue. It has a fine tip on one end and a thicker tip on the other end that I never use. I bought this glue for the applicator alone. My plan is to use it up and then refill it with the more generic version of Elmer's glue. So that being said, this probably isn't the best glue for fabric crafts. It's been working well for me, I would say, but it has a stronger grip. So if you make a mistake, it might be harder to undo and fix it. Also, if you want to press your seams open, this probably isn't the glue for you. A little bit goes a long way too. I've been using it all year and I haven't even gotten halfway through the bottle. For those of you who are only interested in the applicator, it was pretty easy to remove the um, tip from the wide end, but I haven't been able to put it back, so keep that in mind. But that should be easy enough to um, fill up with my regular Elmer's glue. Personally, I haven't had much trouble using this glue for glue basting as long as I use a light hand with it. Don't go crazy, a little bit is just enough. My two best tips if you're planning on using this for glue basting is store it with the point down so that the glue is always ready to be used. And um, when you're using it, apply it in dots and not in long lines. Bonus tip, protect your iron. This stuff can be messy if you get it on there. Just don't do it. And in fact, if you're not in a hurry, you can just let the glue air dry. So in summary, the fine tip applicator works great. It helps you glue base with precision, but the board mate variety of glue might be a bit too strong for some. And remember, Elmer's glue stick is always a great option. It might not be as precise, but it works really well. In fact, I just used it to glue base some binding on my 4th of July um, flag quilt block. And if you're trying out new glues on the market, something you're not familiar with and you just want to give it a try, make sure you get a washable variety because you don't want to leave that in your um, fabric. So washable formula, washable. If you want to try out this glue for yourself or you just want to get your hands on this applicator, I'm going to leave a link in the description below.